Hello, and we are live. That looks like my webcam isn't working. Well, yeah, I fixed that. There we go. All right, it looks like we are up and running. And we started a little bit late tonight, but uh, I was going to wait for uh, Wingman, but I uh, ended up going on without him. We did have a Tomcat in here. Not close by though, about 2,000 miles away. We'll see if it uh, comes near us. But uh, you may have noticed tonight we are not back in air to ground ordnance. It's going to be doing a combat air patrol. In fact, while I'm on deck, I'm going to go ahead and remove these pylons. We won't be eating those, and they do cause a little bit of drag. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and get airborne for a case one launch. And go rendezvous with the tanker. Count 310 launching cap on outbound. I think I had my in speed set right on that. That was at 200. And with these slick wings though, this thing goes quick. A default F-18 in the session. Oh, it's like on the uh, Hawkeye's radar. It's over by the spawn in airport. So, uh, I go say hi to the tanker, and then uh, head on uh, out that way. He doesn't come over to us first. We're only uh, 11 miles away, so he's not running pack pack. you will likely see this with labels, and he's going to come on over here. Which, on uh, the Hawkeye, it does look like he's doing. Uh, Tower 310 is outbound. behind us. Yeah. It should be up on our six o'clock now. The default F-18. So we'll, uh, we'll get our we'll get a look at him at some point. launch anymore tonight, but go ahead and do it anyways. Extend the tanker's rogue. Be right next to him on ours. Might be a little bit below us. There he is. Left. 
properly. We were. Come on, Doc, get it together. I actually got plenty of gas still. John Oliver is left me. I think that was our uh, Tom Captain earlier. Top off our tanks. Town thirty one zero switch is safe now. It's called looking for one K. Zero is receiving fuel. Well, look at that, we're already topped off. Seventeen point six. Quick little sip. Three one zero disconnected. How's it going, Arc Trooper? Finally back in the skies. We've been still doing a stream every Saturday, but it's just not been a consistent time. I've never been able to get around consistently. I still does not have anything on the radar. Wow, well, uh, we'll go over to the airport for right now. Spawn in airport. We do have that uh, set up at a different location this time. It right there. Still in Iceland. It's a little bit larger. Uh, kind of a, a little bit bigger aircraft. to the server computer. It's down there somewhere. Over there. I 
be inside the building, depending on how uh, the scenery is turned up. It was actually, uh, today's mission is just a uh, combat air patrol. We did have a Tomcat flying in here earlier, but he is no longer in here. But there's actually nothing on the ground today to kill. Of course, would not want to do this in real life. Just uh, thrust alone on the runway it would, you know. Of course, if you did it over grass, it would probably destroy quite a bit of grass. But um, probably wouldn't even be uh, healthy for the runway either. Not to mention, it wouldn't be safe. It would be unnecessarily safe. And there's the Hawkeye right there to a uh, high alpha pass on that. Get away with it. Hawkeye. Yeah, of course, you would not want to get that low IRL. It's fun to do it in the sim. Oh, why your stream freezes something? Oh, shoot. It's freezing on you? Let me look at the stream health. Ooh, yeah. I see that. It dropped off a few times. The, the internet here is really inconsistent. Hmm. 
I guess we have the RTV. Oh, oh well, uh, we, we still got quite a bit of gas to burn even before we're at uh, max trap weight. We still got uh, 14,000 pounds aboard. 14,300 pounds. 200 now. So I'll uh, loiter for a little bit and see if anything shows up. This is going to be the airport they probably fly out of. impromptu air show for the airport and probably messed up quite a bit of their uh, landscaping how long it takes to burn uh, depending on what your power setting is and your altitude it, it varies quite a bit um, like if I stayed at full burners at sea level or you know under 5,000 feet or so I could probably burn that off well within five minutes you know and especially if I'm jumping at the same time um, but up here at like Angel 35 or so yeah, it's gonna take especially if you're like at mill power or uh, or minimum burners it might take you know you could probably be up there for an hour or two max loiter time the thing about the super Orient is you can actually the uh, flight computer will actually tell you right here and uh, the FPAS system. So right now at my current power setting, at my current altitude, my endurance is uh, hour and 20 minutes until I'm at, uh, I'm, until I'm at 2,000 pounds of gas. And 2,000 pounds is pretty much when you get the fuel low warning and everything like that. 2,000 pounds, it, it sounds like a, like a lot of gas. It's a ton of gas, you know, so you think that's a lot of gas, but fighter jets can actually go through it pretty darn quick especially when they're low altitude but on um, the best uh, mock if I wanted to loiter here for the max amount of time it says if I did 0.77 mock at this altitude I could sit here for three hours about or two hours and 58 minutes so that's about the max amount of time now we do have that tanker out there so that you know we could always use, utilize that to stay on station even longer but I'm not anticipating being on station that long. I'm thinking maybe, maybe give this about uh, 15, 20 minutes, and uh, and probably going back in for uh, case one recovery. All right, I'm going to go ahead and switch back over to transmit and receive for the ship's tack in. Uh, I'll also switch this back over to radar and go uh, nose high. Dude, give me a gas. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, 2,000 pounds of gas. It's a, these jets burn through it real quick, especially if you're in burners. Like right now, I'm not burning too much gas. Um, you actually see it in the engine fuel display right here. The fuel flow is uh, it, it, that's calculated in uh, thousands of pounds per hour, or really, actually, it's it's in pounds per hour. It's, it's, yeah, but. It, I would be burning uh, 4,000, at my current power setting, I'm burning 4,200 pounds of gas every hour in each engine. So that's a total of 8,000 pounds. So that gives me a little over two hours. And I bet if we go back to half pass, it will confirm that for us. Yeah, so we're about an hour and 23 minutes, I'm guess, until we get to 2,000 pounds, which that's the 2,000. I'm basing this calculation on that engine fuel display off of uh, fuel flow rate. Oh, Sean Oliver is left again. Shoot, yeah, he he did have a uh, attack back. And we go ahead and hold on to Angels 35. Could uh, burn some gas, maybe. I'm thinking, and uh, and just do uh, some uh, case one recoveries. Yeah, I think I'm gonna 
gonna do that. Burn down to uh, 8,000 pounds. Although, actually, uh, cease my dump right now. Let's put in a drone to shoot at. Actually, now we'll burn 10 miles out. I don't feel like chasing them too far. They'll uh, burn us. Uh, burn quite a bit of gas chasing them down. Even if he's uh, that close. That's one of the big things is if we get jumped mid uh, mid flight, you know, like that's a that's a big factor in the decision that I make, you know, whether I pursue someone or not, or like whether I shoot a missile or not is my fuel state. Just because it, as you can see, like we're at 12,000 pounds right now. By the time this fight's over, I bet we're not going to be anywhere near that. There's our uh, bogey or bandit. We'll go ahead and classify him as a bandit if we're already possible. What do you think, Inver Joust? Give him a shot. And we wanted to there. Uh, pretty tough pull. Go max out around. Yeah, we're cranking it. Oh, yeah, we are supersonic. There we were. Oops. Just that. before we reset it. good burst on him that time all right so yeah that was uh, 3,000 pounds of gas hmm oh that was actually making a noise I heard some burning noise back there but yeah, we'll be uh, we'll be down to maximum trap weight by the time we trap. So we went through. What is that? Uh, Hundred and eighteen rounds. The one bandit. Not quite ideal. off our radar. Oh, and we have uh, not dropped our hook yet. Bingo. Bingo. Three one zero. Bingo. Control. Three one zero platform seven point. Three 
the ones you're in for the tough and a radio system. Radio. Oh. 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 O
310 is about 180. One zeros at the 90 run of all 6.7 touch and go. One more stage out. Yeah, gotta clean that up. That would have been a three wire. We're gonna go ahead and do a rested landing. Oh, Sean Oliver has just rejoined. Ah, shoot, he left again. I was about to say we might have uh, might have gone back out on patrol. close here. Beam. Talent the re one zero is at the one eight. Zeroes at that 90 run of all 6.4. Level high. Wire, I think right on the edge of the E bracket. We're still showing a, a red arrow though. Our AOA indexer. But I think I'm going to call it a stream there. Appreciate you tuning in, Art Trooper. What am I going to do off stream? <laughs> Uh, laggy as fuck. Shoot, man. Yeah, sorry to hear. I'm not sure. Yeah, I gotta... I gotta go grab some food, at least for right now. But, um... Yeah, appreciate you tuning in. And, uh... Yeah, it's a shame we didn't uh, have any... I was planning on doing at least some intercepts tonight. Uh, the server crashed right before we went live. Uh, maybe like... Five minutes before or so. We had a lot of people, and I was planning on just doing a combat air patrol, you know, doing intercepts, but uh, not a lot of people came back. All right. Sean Oliver keeps coming and going. But, um, yeah, appreciate you tuning in. That sucks badly. Yeah, <laughs> the server crashed. Oh, yeah. But yeah, I hope everyone has a good rest of your weekend. Appreciate you tuning in. And yeah, as always, happy flying. Until next time.